Okie dokie. In this problem, they ask which of the graphs below represents a function. So in order to be a function, it must pass what's known as the vertical line test. What that means is if we introduce a vertical line here, if there are any two points that lie on the same vertical line, then that graph does not represent a function. So as we scan through, we see that graph A has two points that lie on the same vertical line. What that means is the same input, the same x value is producing two outputs, and that's what makes it not a function. So for one input, we're getting two outputs. In other words, two dots on the same vertical line. That means graph A is not a function. And then let's scan through B. Good, 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 good. Ah, right at the end there, we have two points on the same vertical line or two outputs for a single input, which means that graph B is also not a function. So neither A nor B is a function. Let's go ahead and do one more example very quickly. Let's break out our vertical line here. Scanning through A, one, two, three. Ah, look at that, two points on the same vertical line. Graph A is not a function. How about graph B? Bam, 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 bam. These two are close, but still, no, we're good. All right, so it doesn't look like, it doesn't look like any two points were on the same vertical line for B. So that means B is a function. So only graph B represents a function. So B is our answer, and we're done.